in my other video, I talked about J. Edgar Hoover having African-American ancestry, and you see him in the upper left-hand corner. President Dwight D. Eisenhower's mother was said to be of mixed blood from Africa and she, that she was a mulatto. And there you have here on the left-hand side, they say that Dwight Eisenhower's mother was an orphan named Ida Stover. And then she married a young German immigrant named David Eisenhower. Warren G. Harding is also said to have African ancestry. They said that his father was a mulatto, 50% uh, black, 50% white. And there's never really no pure 50%. And Harding's great-grandmother was black. They also spread rumors that his great-great-grandfather was a West Indian black and that other blacks might be found in his family tree. A lot of people want to dismiss these rumors, but I always say where there's smoke, there's fire. And his father's name was George Harding, if I'm... Then, of course, there's always Abraham Lincoln. He's also rumored to have African-American ancestry. But I was surprised about this one. They believe that Abraham Lincoln's mother, Nancy Hanks, was claimed to be of African descent, descent Ethiopian. They said Lincoln had very dark skin. His cheeks were leathery and saffron colored. And his hair was dark, almost black. Hmm. Andrew Jackson, the Indian killer. He said his mother was held to public scorn as a prostitute who intermarried with a Negro and his eldest brother was sold as a slave in Carolina. They said that Jackson had color blood, meaning Negro ancestry. And of course, of course, they're not going to, to admit if they had uh, African-American ancestry. They'll never admit to that. Then we have Thomas Jefferson. They said his mother, Jane Randolph Jefferson, was of mixed race ancestry. And John Adams accused Jefferson of being half Indian and half the N-word and half Frenchman. And he was born to a mulatto father or slave in a half-breed Indian squaw. And then, of course, we have President Calvin Coolidge, who was also said to have a mixed-race family. His mother, Victoria Moore, was claimed to be of a mixed-race family in Vermont. Her surname was derived from Moore, a European term for people of North Africa. And the Moors uh, brought a lot of knowledge and science and math to the Spaniards. And they uh, sailed on Columbus' ship as his uh, navigators, chief navigators who helped him to get to the New World. So these are just some interesting points. Of course, they're going to say it's unsubstantiated because they're not going to claim it. But what bothers me is that African-Americans cannot claim their Native American ancestry, and they pretty much have it locked down. You can't use a DNA test. You have to use records from the courthouse, like birth certificates and so forth. And we know that many of our records are lost.